Have you ever wanted to change your phone to different colors on the screen? Also, if you're colorblind and you're having some problems, this will help you with that. We're going to go through and show you exactly how to set all that up. And who knows, maybe someone got a hold of your phone and changed it and you want to get the colors back. This will go ahead and show you how to do all of these things. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin with HelpfulTutorials.net. If you're new here and you like iPhone tips, tricks, tutorials, and carrier conversations, please do me a favor and smack that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. Let's go ahead and just jump right in here. Let's go ahead and first thing we're going to do is choose settings. So once we get into settings here, we're going to look for accessibility. Let's go ahead and choose that. Next, we're going to go ahead and look for display and text size. And now that we're in here, we're going to go ahead and scroll down to the bottom. And there's going to be something there that says color filters. Let's go ahead and choose those. Before we do, though, we'll read what it says. Color filters can be used to differentiate colors by users who are colorblind and aid users who have difficulty reading text on the display. It also changes the colors if you want to change them because there's really no other way. There is a way to go ahead and change it to dark mode. And if that's what you're looking for, I do have a video for that. I'll go ahead and put it up at the top. Go ahead and check that video out and that'll help you. This is more for other colors. And let's go ahead and just jump in and show you exactly what I mean. Once we're in here, we're going to see the color pencils at the top that give you a good idea of what you're currently seeing with the color scale. So let's go ahead and turn it on and right away it goes to grayscale. So if you want everything just gray and no colors, you could do that. Next, you have red and green filters, which is protonopia. So that will go through and help if you are that type of colorblind. Those are the colors you'll currently see. Next, we have green and red filters, eutronopia. That's also for colorblind. And then next we have Tritonopia, which is blue and yellow filters. So you can choose these and see what you like. You could also choose color tint, which will go ahead and give you more of like a glossy look. So even though I'm changing it on my iPhone and it's not going to change it on the display itself. And that's simply because I'm using a program that is not interpreting that. So just know the colors are changing as I'm selecting them. If we choose intensity, let's see if, yeah, you can't see it on the screen itself, but I can see it here. And that's simply because it's changing the screen itself. It's not actually changing the software. So that's why it's not showing up when I do this. I tried even recording my screen itself with the iPhone program and it doesn't show that way. But trust me, you will see a difference as you go ahead and make these changes visually on your side. If this video helped you, do me a favor. Please go ahead and smack that like button. Share this out so other people are aware of this. And I have a video on helpfultutorials.net tips and tricks that's absolutely free if you want to check that out. Thank you so much for the view. Here are some other videos I think you'll enjoy.